Today is a monumental milestone. It's the first time commercial cars actually go on the road driving at the toughest possible test that you can have. And you'll be able to say that you were there on April 26, 2010, when the first electric taxi actually took to the road in Japan. The first EV taxis will be able to switch their batteries here. And by switching the batteries, they'll be able to extend the range. The battery switch process takes as little as 60 seconds. And that's much shorter than filling up a regular taxi. Here, uh, we are capable of handling as many as 12 batteries to ensure a constant supply of freshly charged batteries to the EVs. The batteries are charged in a temperature control environment, and that ensures safety, reliability, and efficiency of the batteries. Most car makers said it was impossible. Today, not only is it possible, it's actually driving in the street, picking up passengers. It's, it's important to prove our concept in Japan because Japan just doesn't believe in the conceptual thinking only. You have to show things actually what works. So it's very important to physically to demonstrate what we can do. Well, in Tokyo, taxis represent 2% of the total cars, but they are responsible for 20% of the total emissions. So by eliminating the taxi emission, we'll be eliminating a large chunk of tailpipe emissions. If you have a taxi driver going to Tokyo, every day we've done 30 demonstrations to 30 different people that electric cars are better. And I guarantee you they're going to ask the driver, does this thing really work? And when they say not only does it work, it works better, it's quieter, I actually like it better than my older taxi, you got the ultimate demonstration.